awesome. Sometimes you just gotta yell a word to make yourself feel that way. You're feeling sad? Just yell, Everything's wonderful! And if you're feeling ugly, I'm Johnny Depp, or a young Burt Reynolds. Unless you're a woman, then you'd say, I'm a female version of a young Burt Reynolds. Ugh. And if you're feeling broke, I'm a successful investment banker. And if you become too much of a douche because you're a successful investment banker, I'm homeless and not by choice. And if you drag a joke on for way too long, I'm hilarious. So last night I watched a program on the History Channel called America. The story of us. That sort of excludes anyone who wants to watch that's not from America, doesn't it? E pluribus f you. Shouldn't it be called America? The story of uh, Americans and those that have affected America's history, which is everyone. That aside, it is a very good show. The British are not portrayed very well, though. Now I kind of feel the same way about British people that I felt about sharks after I watched Jaws. I will not be taking a dip in the UK anytime soon for fear of my leg getting taxed off. I realize the story of the American Revolution is probably told very differently to those outside the US. If you don't live here, do you even know who Paul Revere is? Because I think if I didn't live here, I probably wouldn't know, but I'm an idiot. And if I did know, I'd probably hate knowing. Useless knowledge. But I do know, because I am a successful, beautiful American. I'm homeless and not by choice. While watching, I noticed this technique the History Channel uses to hold your attention. Every time it was approaching some sort of major historical event, and would happen next, changed this video forever. They would say something like, What happened next changed the world forever. But really, you could say that about anything. What happened next changed the world forever. I'm changing the world. I'm changing the world. I'm changing the world. That cup, my wallet, and CD cases are not in the exact same place they were before, and never will be. Even Craig with a wig changes the world. Who's Craig, Eddie Craig? Craig with the wig? Now I have something very important to talk to you about. What happened next changed the outro music forever, hopefully starting with the next video. I'm looking for new outro music. Not a drastic change. I want it to be the same melody and the same length, just different music. You can send it to wheezyoutro at gmail.com or you can make it a video response. Wheezy line. I, I don't remember how it goes. You're just gonna have to listen to the end. Now if you'll excuse me, I think the coffee's done. I love it when the coffee's done. What happened next changed the amount of caffeine in Craig's body for the next several hours. I just made that face for the freeze frame. I'm hilarious. In the post-outro, let's enjoy some coffee and some bad news. I won't be doing videos for the next three days due to obligations. Sorry. I'll see you guys on Friday. Here's an example. <clears throat> I just hit my chin. <laughs>